This is Silver Sports TV. Or should I say, welcome to Silver Sports TV. Make sure you hit the like, subscribe, and share button. Support the cash app at Silver Sports TV. I'm going to say this shit professionally tonight. I am. Just, eh, eh, eh. All right. Shout out to the mother. He, there you shit. I'm going to say this professional tonight. At Silver Sports TV, I be that nigga. Big Gooch. All right. I'm here for another edition of Silver Sports TV. Make sure to hit the like, subscribe, and share button. And we're here to cover Miami versus Boston. Game six. I'm going to run down on the other games, too, if I have a little time. But my main focus is the, the game tonight, the, the, the main task at night. We don't, we don't like to dwell on the past. We don't like to dwell on the present, what's in front of us right now. And this is the present. You got a past, you got a present, and you got a future. This right here is just the present. Miami Heat versus Boston Celtics. Game six in Boston. Ooh, right there. You say, damn. Uh, uh, uh. We got a game tonight. Oh, we had a game tonight, too. Oh, we definitely had a game tonight. We had a game tonight. But before I get into any, any stats and breakdown of the game, I just want to talk about all these i see all these bloggers and all these fuck ass niggas talking about this and this and this these niggas from all the other places and talking about all that like eh. i just want to get something clear man don't get it fucked up now miami is here now we here we are here believe that and we're going back home for game seven now Make the best team win. Made the best team win. It was a good series. I said it from the jump. Boston, is, this is going to be a match. This is game seven potential. Only thing we did tonight, especially after Boston win the last two, only thing we did tonight was let Boston know we still here. All that. I heard the other bloggers saying this and this and that. All that cap ass shit. Nigga, it's just one game. It's just one game. In game six tonight, Miami show you just one game. Everybody said Miami was done. Butler was done. They hurt. We all hurt. We can physically see that. The Miami Heat team, we all hurt. But the fight and bounce back, like how we did tonight. In that tough Boston crowd tonight. It's not easy to win in Boston. See, people don't understand what I'm saying that. Because any sports person know, any teammate know, any team that's not other in Boston that play on the road in Boston know this. This is real shit. It's tough to win in Boston. So Miami played resilient tonight. Before I even get into these sports tonight, man. Welcome to Sipping Sports TV. Make sure you hit the motherfucking like, subscribe, and share button tonight. You want to support the game? You should support the game. You're going to have no other choice in a while. At Sipping Sports TV. Game. Let me get into these stats tonight for game six. Miami versus Boston. In Boston. In the swamp. Uh, uh, uh. Uh, uh, uh. 
Miami came out the gate early. It looked like one of the Miami games. Butler came out early. Kyle came out early. Making shots. It's like, oh, this is like one of the Miami games. Like four minutes left in the quarter, Miami was shooting eight for 14. Boston was only shooting four for 12. Miami won the first quarter, 29-22. Nigga Tess won them quarters. One of them quarters. See? It's one of them quarters. It, it's a good game. Miami was three for six. Boston was two for five. Miami had three turnovers. Boston had five turnovers. But Boston shot eight free throws in that first quarter. Not Miami. Miami Miami ain't shot no free throws in that. Second quarter, 8-17. Boston had a motherfucking 7-0 run on Miami. Harford had three fouls, and Grant Williams had three fouls. They was in foul trouble early, and then and then we see what happened in the game. <clears throat> Kyle Landry got fouled out. You know what I'm saying? Troops got fouled out. Later on in the end, Jalen Brown got fouled out. But come on, man. Come on, man. Six, 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 seventeen in the second quarter. Boston already had shoot 10 free throws of Miami, just two for two. Miami just getting their first two shots then. You to tell me Boston shot the free throw line. So I don't want to hit. Boston got to the line early. Early. Miami was just proficient. Miami was just more proficient. Especially from the three-point line. When the points off turnover early, Boston was winning early in the first quarter, 10 and 7. But we'll get into the real stats behind that. So I'm telling you, man. Boston won the second quarter, 24 to 19. Going into halftime, Butler had 21 halftime, two steals, six assists, nine rebounds. Tucker had six, one steal, one assist, two rebounds. Shroops, who shot the ball pretty bad tonight again, but he made a couple of clutch shots. He only had two points going into halftime. Martin came off the bench. Young boy came off the bench. Regressive with five points, three, three, three. Vincent ain't had nothing. All the depot ain't had nothing at halftime. Miami was like, "Oh man, what is it going to be do?" Butler kept us in the game. Butler and Kyle Landry. Kyle had ten at, at the halftime. Kyle had ten at the halftime, man. Like I told y'all. Boston, Boston won the second quarter, 24 to 19. Halftime for Tatum. Tatum had 18 at halftime. One block, two steals, three assists. Harford ain't had no points. Wow. Harford ain't had no points at halftime. That was surprising to me until, because that was surprising to me. I thought Harford scored a couple times. That was surprising to me. Harford ain't had no points. He had two assists, three steals, and three rebounds. Smart had four points at that time. They turned it up, two rebounds. Greg Williams had no points. Robert White was scoring at half. He, he was scoring. He was doing his motherfucking thing. Yes, he did. He kept them afloat in that game. Third quarter came. 626. Third quarter, Miami started on the seven, seven. Miami went on a seven on run. On the seven on run, shot the three point ball in the third quarter, ten for tw- in the third quarter and over in the third quarter, ten for third twenty one. Boston shot six for nineteen. That's just getting up more attempts than Boston did. That is all. We shot the ball. It was more a little aggressive to Boston tonight. Boston. Boston hurt. You know how they say Miami just hurt. Boston hurt too. 
Like this is a this is, this is a tough game. This is a tough series, man. Boston ain't shot the ball that good. Wait till we get to the field goal range and stuff tonight. Boston individually, Tatum shot what uh, nine for twelve tonight, he thirty points. But Boston ain't shot the the, the ball that for professional night. Like we got to keep it a buck with you. Miami did what they did, even though Bam ain't even got into the game tonight, which we're gonna need Bam to get into the game. We're gonna need Tyler Hero, but. I, I, I just gonna break down the game for you, and then I'm gonna break down the stats for you, man. That's all, man. Sip, at Sipping Sports TV, this is Sipping Sports TV, man. Make sure you like, subscribe, and hit the share button, man. That's all, man. Third quarter, Miami won the third quarter, thirty-four to twenty-nine. That normally the game changer right there. And see, one thing about these last two games, it wasn't really blowouts at the half times like that. Yeah, Miami had the stamp on the game, but Boston was distant. Boston actually came back now in this game. So it wasn't no landslide in this game. It was more up and down than anything in the score than the score predicted. Let's see. Third quarter, Miami outscored Boston 34 to 29. Full quarter, Miami went a full quarter by one point. 29-28. Miami made more clutch baskets in the key than they did. Shroops got fouled out. Tucker got fouled out. Jalen Brown got fouled out. You know what I'm saying? Jimmy Butler didn't. Jason Tatum only took one shot. In the fourth quarter, he went one for one. If I'm reading these stats wrong, I know I'm not. He went one for one in the fourth quarter. Jason Tatum. Tatum, your best player now. He went one for one. After Kyle Landry fouled out. Kyle Landry got us 18 and 10 tonight. That's solid minutes for Kyle. We got to remember, Miami is banged up. But there's no excuses. We is not making no excuses for nobody tonight, but we're going to keep it a funky because we don't see these niggas on their other platforms and they don't keep it a buck. So we're going to keep it a buck. This shit is going to game seven. That's a fact. It is going to game seven. Miami win 111 and 103. 111 and 103. This is a good game. The same thing happened to Miami last game, but Miami was just horrible last game. I literally couldn't make shots. If Miami could have made a little bit of the shots they made this game, they could have beat Boston last game. But we didn't make nothing last game. It was so horrible. We're going to get into the scores, man. We're going to break this shit down, man. The right way, man. Team comparisons. I got to I always go over the losing team. I always do. So don't feel no type of way. <laughs> Boston shot 32 for 72 tonight. That's 44 percent. Miami shot 36 for 78. Miami shot the ball 46 percent tonight. On the road in Boston. Miami shot the no, I've got to go to Boston, like I say, right? So I don't want to say I, I just so happy right now to t- go to game seven because I'm confident. I don't hear all these other hating ass. Don't want to be on my man. Listen, we here. And I heard don't be biased, but listen, you got to tell them what well, I right. what you believe in. Straight heat nation. And that's all I'm saying. All right. So you're right. Let me report the news right to these niggas on Sipping Sports TV tonight. I covered the losing team first. So with that being said, three-pointer tonight. Except the shot the ball 11 for 33. 33%. That's like Larry Bird number. 333. I got some Illuminati somewhere in that motherfucker. Tell you, shoot three, 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 all them threes like that. That's scary. <laughs> but meanwhile, Miami shot the ball 15 for 35. 42%. 42% night for them three ball tonight. After what we shot the ball from the whole field goal last game. 
It was so disgusting. My man ain't want to cover the game. Jesus. Jesus. I don't feel go differential. I don't really like to cover this. Miami shot 24 for 25, 96%. Boston shot 20 for 31. Because I don't call the game. Unless shoot is over shooting free throw. That don't really call the game. This will get the game fucked up at. Assist. Miami out system 25-22. Uh, that's not too big of a difference. But total rebounds tonight. Wow. Finally. Finally. Miami out rebounding tonight. Totally. But not by much either, though. 37-34. So it's still with a toss-up with big ass Harford. You got big ass Robert Williams, and you got Grant Williams. Miami only got Bam down there. Only Bam. And you got Detman coming off the bench, but you only got Bam. And they saying Bam ain't active. It's hard for you to get going off. You got to go out this big ass beast all day. Total rebounds. I said that over 30, 37 and 34. Offensive rebounds. Am I able to win that battle? Wow. By, listen, not even by, uh, you could say a large, by five, 11 to six. That is how lack of days ago Boston was at home tonight. Boston ain't look like they want to close the game out tonight in game six in Boston. After being up 3 2 tonight, I'm sorry. These numbers right now let me know Boston was more lack of data than Miami. Like, they was in the game. Would they dominate Miami every time? Like, defensive rebounds. They win that. Boston win that, 28-26. It's like Boston was in the game. Like, offensive rebounds right there. That's a That was a plus for us tonight. That was a plus for us tonight. So, for us to totally out-rebound them, our assistant, we shot the ball, the field goal better than them, and the three ball better than them. Tied up with the steals. We both had 10-10 with the steals. They had four blocks, of course. They got Robert Williams down there. Come on, man. Al Harford, come on, man. They got they got athletic people down there. They got Tatum, a little slim and athletic. They got Jalen Brown, a little more bigger than Tatum, but athletic. Like they got people that like I can block the ball and they can fan. That's why Boston one of the that's why Boston was ranked the number one defense now. Let's not get it twisted. Number one, number two. Let's keep it a buck now. We're not gonna uh not give Boston the credit. But tonight, Miami, Miami, no, we had to extend this series. We wasn't ready to go home tonight. I'ma cover this. I'ma cover this 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 Dallas and um Golden State game too. But we wasn't ready to go home tonight. We wasn't ready to go home tonight. Why I say I'm gonna cover the Dallas in it because because Dallas showed a little grit to at the end, but it was too late. It was too late, man. It was too late, man. Points out for turnovers. Boston win that battle by one point, 23-22. That's what I'm saying. This game was like right there for the taking. Only different was. It was a points different from the best two players in, in, in the game, from the best two players on, uh, on the team. It was a difference from Butler 47 and Tatum 30. That's the difference right there. You do the math right there. What did I tell you? That's 17-point different right there. Even though the score don't show that, but that was a 17-point different from the best player on the court tonight. And in game six, in Boston, the best man on the court going to get the job done. And Butler say he the best man on the court. And I just hope this whole team and him get healthy for this game seven. Because it's only one game. one. It's only one day off and it's Sunday. And we back to it. So let's go back to Miami. And let's get ready to close these boys out. And go to Golden State or Golden State coming us. It don't matter which way we go. Let us get ready to go play some finals basketball. That's all I'm saying. Let's go play some finals basketball, man. 
We're gonna get into it. We're gonna be biased and around like the evening. But no, they was. We're gonna get to the box score tonight. A couple of losing teams all the time. Even if Miami lose, we cover losing team first. Tatum played 45 minutes tonight. 30 points, nine rebounds, four assists, two steals, one block. Tatum shot nine for 12, like I told y'all earlier in it. 75% tonight. I mean, he only take 12 shots shooting that proficient, and he only take 12 shots when he got when he got three people on his team shot took more shots than him, and he even got more points than him. Wow. I mean, he's hurting. Maybe he hurt. Or maybe it's all this shit is the hooks right now. Oh, they hurt. They hurt. Tatum gave me 30 points tonight. Tatum shot t- nine for 12. Tatum missed. Three shots tonight. Taylor missed three shots tonight. 75% shoot went, and he shot the ball four for seven. In threes. That's 58%, 57%. Eight for eight for free throw line. Wow. Taylor shot proficient. Jalen Brown, 41 minutes, 20 points, six rebounds, five assists, three assists. He shot six for 13 tonight. That's 46%. They shot the ball together efficient tonight. 46% is good in any game. Shooting the ball. That's keeping the ball. 75 is like, nigga, I'm, you shoot the ball out of this level right now. Like, that's keeping the, that's keeping the buck. Now, these stats just make you be like, I'm mad Tatum shoot the ball they were with you. As a Boston fan, I'll be like, why is Tatum going to take 12 shots tonight? Why? Jalen Brown only took one more shot other than him. He went six for 13. Tatum went nine for 12. Why? Tatum man took another shot. More shots. Brown went one for three in the three ball. That's 33%. He shot seven for nine free throws. They both got to the line tonight. They both got to the line tonight. They shot 17 shots together. Tatum shot eight. He shot, Brown shot nine. Uh-uh-uh. I don't want to hear this. Oh, hey, Jalen Brown fuck shit. It ain't that. Stop pointing the finger when the Celtics blew on everybody else and, 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 and point the real stats out and tell them what's really going on. Now. Tatum got to get more aggressive now. That's a superstar for Boston, right? Come on now. And we, we ain't coming at Tatum. Hell of a player. Hell of a player. But we got to keep it funky now and keep that shit a buck. These niggas be high capping. We got to keep it real now. We got to keep it real. Let's keep it going. For the minutes. 40 minutes for Marcus Smart tonight. 14 points, four rebounds, three assists. Four for 15 tonight. He jacked a ass of three tonight. Let me get into it. He went one for nine tonight. I know he did. I know he did. I know he did. He jacked a ass three tonight. For real. Salute to my nigga. Big Titan TV. Salute to you, brother. Salute. For Sipping Sports TV. Take a shot, brother. Take a shot. For real, man. For real, man. Let's keep it a buck, man. Like, we, 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 we got to call these niggas out, man. Come on, man. Marcus Smart shot 15 shots a night. He shot more shots than they can tell him tonight. And then we want to say, oh, 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 oh. But, man, everybody was saying, oh, 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 oh Miami going to lose this. Miami this, this, this. Come on, man. Miami show grit, bro. Miami show grit. Miami show championship mentality. Miami show youth, growth, all that. I mean, no disrespect to them young boys now. But Miami this show now. Don't just cancel us out like this now. Fuck it, nigga. Win, lose, or draw. No complaining. Like, Miami ball last night, man. Shout out to the Heat, man. Come on, man. That's what they don't want to do. He had to shoot the ball over there. Now, Al Harford tonight. Al Harford only had three points tonight? Oh, man. Oh, man, I'm, this is the truth. Three points tonight in 32 minutes? Oh, oh, oh. I'm in the big Al. He running out. He got nine rebounds, five assists. Nigga shot the ball one for eight from field goal today. That's 12%. One for six for three. That's sixteen percent. What happened, to Big Al tonight? What happened, to Big Al? Big Al ran out of gas tonight. Tired. 
<laughs> Catch up with Big Al. Big Al tied. <laughs> it's Big Al tied, man. This is what I do out here. This is Sipping Sports TV, man. Welcome to Sipping Sports TV. Make sure you hit the like, subscribe, and share button, man. Real, man. Welcome yourself, man. The screen number is right there. If you ever want to pull up and question me, this shit is like first take to me and Stephen A. Smith. The platform is there. Pull up. I give you a secret service or however you want it. Pause. Man. Pull up and talk to a gangster, nigga. Real shit. We on Sipping Sports TV, man. Back to the back to the business, man. Back to the big one. Robert Williams, 26 minutes tonight. Tw- 12, re- 12 points, one rebound. You mean tell me Robert Williams would have had one rebound tonight? This can't be the final stats of this game tonight, but it's the re- it's real true. One rebound tonight. Robert Williams. And we all talking about oh, Robert Williams is is, is the factor. Yeah, he really is the factor, but tonight he was not a factor. I can see why Miami went. I could see I would have been even upset if Miami had lost this game. Rob Williams had one rebound. One rebound, but 12 points. One rebound. Wow, I never thought this shit. I'm going to keep it buck with you. Reading this stat, I was like, wow. One rebound. Al, Al Harford and Tatum tied. With the most rebounds in the game for the Celtics tonight. I see why Miami won the rebound by like what three? <laughs> well, you got Al Harford and Tatum. And you got Robert Williams only getting one. That's the biggest man on the court. On the court. In 26 minutes. It gets you 12 points, though. You get 12 points. Two blocks. Five for seven from the field goal. He's a big man, you know. Five for seven for field goal. Seventy-one percent. You know that. Easy barbecue chicken, like how Shaq said that. That's easy down there for him. But I was surprised. This was a shock tonight. Derek Williams off the bench tonight. Derek White off the bench tonight. Get if I don't get it fucked up. Derek White came from San Antonio off the bench tonight. He played thirty-two minutes. He had twenty-two points, three rebounds, five assists, three steals. One block. He shot seven for 14 tonight. He shot 50% tonight from field goal. He shot more shots than Tatum tonight. This is what I'm trying to tell you. You got one, two, three players shot more shots than Tatum tonight. That's smart. Brown and White off the bench shot more shots than Tatum tonight. But But Tatum shot more proficient than every last one of them. Brown shot 46%. Smart shot 26%. White shot 50%. Tatum shot 75% tonight from the field goal. Like, what is it like? I don't know. What it was, what, giving Miami a game? By that, but how the hell you give somebody a game in your hometown? We got a chance you can go. I'm pretty sure y'all just watched Golden State hold them trophies up last night. The whole world just watched that. For y'all to say, oh, oh, okay, we just go get Miami again. We just go get Miami again. Like, oh man, let's go get Miami again. These people, is, oh man, Boston played a horrible, horrible tonight. Horrible tonight. Derek White shot four for seven in three tonight, fifty-seven percent. Derek White would have been their damn best player besides Taylor tonight. Tell you the truth. Yeah, I know Jalen Brown had 20, but he went he went six for 13. It's not bad. 47% on the missed seven shots, but you're talking about aggressive coming off the bench. Derek White went seven for 14, man. Not that night. Like. What happened to Pritchard? Oh, Greg Williams. Greg Williams ain't foul trouble early. He went two for two. And Pritchard. You put them X factors. You put them out the game. And Miami did a good job of that tonight. Putting them out the game. Putting them out the game. We're getting these Miami stats, man. We're going to keep it going. Jimmy Butler tonight. 45 minutes. 47 points. Nine rebounds. Eight assists. Four steals. One block. 
Jimmy went 16 for 29 field goals tonight. That's 55% tonight. Who the fuck say Jimmy? All right. These niggas been watching Jimmy up. And Jimmy also, oh, listen. <laughs> I got something to make y'all laugh right now. And make y'all be like, oh, okay. Jimmy went four for eight tonight in threes tonight. That's 50%. Took eight of them bitches tonight. Made four of them. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. That's Miami Heat basketball. People that know me, this is Sipping Sports TV. My people who know me. Let's go. 11 for 11. Ain't free throws tonight. Shot 11 attempts tonight. It is well deserved. Need more than that, to tell you the truth. Wait, he be getting called. Wait, he be driving to the basket. They don't call for him. Real. My nigga Bam tonight. Bam, bam, bam tonight. Then you know I gotta say something about Bam before I talk because Bam tonight. Like, God damn. Brick City. I wanna bring some of them jerseys up tonight. I'm bringing my wife over with jersey. If you wanna come up one night and talk your shit. I'm bringing my wife over with jersey tonight. I, I I bring a wife up here tonight for jersey. You wanna bring come up and talk your shit tonight for jersey? Because we, cause, cause, cause we got to talk about Bam right now. 41 minutes in that. Six, re, six points, nine rebounds, two assists. Three a six from the field goal. 50 cent. I'm saying that like Tatum right now, but at least Tatum had 30. But now for 12, Bam had to give us more. But what if Butler don't outscore Tatum by 17 points? Them bam points right there. Butler scored him and bam points. So we I, I fucks with bam, but this is a game seven now. And these are some young boys. These some young boys now. These some young boys now. This Boston Celtic team is some young boys. We're not fucking sitting here. We're not fitting to sit here and act like, oh, the series is over. I, look, it, it literally tell you the truth. I see Gordon State celebrate like goddamn Minnesota when Minnesota beat the Clippers. Like, like they wouldn't check the shit by red. I should go to state doing that yesterday. They're all on TNT with Shaq and Chuck now. Like it's all over yet. Like, yeah. Like they guarantee win championship. Yeah, all right. That's why that's why Peter took a seat where he said to dream on. All right. I just hope we get there. All right. All right. This thing is over yet. Uh-uh-uh. This is Sipping Sports TV, man. I Sipping Sports TV tonight. I'm trying to get my wife. You know what I'm saying? You know what I'm saying? That's the biggest supporter anyway. I get my wife to tap in tonight. T -t Tell her to get on and talk your shit. She, she thinks she can out talk me in basketball anyway. She know I'm the GOAT. Get, get on and talk your shit tonight, Queen. Get on here. Why I cover these starts tonight? <laughs> Let me get back to Bam. Look, oh, that's where it started. When I start my Bam right now, that's Jersey love. Bam. From Jersey. 41 minutes, six points, nine rebounds, two assists tonight, one steal from Bam. Bam shot three for six. That's 50%. I told Bam. I told Bam. You know what I'm saying? That's 50%. That's good. That's good. 50%. But you have to do more, Bam. You have to give me more than you had to, Bam, you have to give me, please. You really have to give me more than motherfucking six shots tonight. Sorry. Six points. You have to give me more than that. It's Sibin Sports TV. Who that? Tap in. Talk to me. That's Sibin Sports TV. My nigga Kyle Landry. Kyle Landry played 36 minutes tonight. Kyle was a plus tonight. Kyle was a plus tonight. In 36 minutes, 18 points. Four rebounds, 10 assists. Kyle had a double-double tonight. In his minutes, he got fouled out late in the quarter. Like, I read the stats to y'all. Five something in the He got fouled out. But Miami hold it down. Kyle shot five for 14 tonight. That was 35 percent. He shot four for nine and three point in line, though. That did that 44 percent and shot four for four from the three and shot four for four from the field goal line. So, yeah, Kyle was productive tonight, and we needed that. We needed that. People step up for Miami tonight, man. I, I, I told my woman all I needed was four pieces again, double figure tonight, and look at by the box score tonight. I got four in double figures tonight. I got, you, you, 
I you know it. I'm mad at Bam tonight. Yeah, Bam. Oh, got, yeah, 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 yeah. Be mad if you get back to Bam tonight, cause Bam. Yeah, Jesus, yeah. you cannot. You're the tallest one. You was the tallest one on that team. You um, got to fucking but, do but more. But you the tallest one on our team. On the Miami team, I'm just yeah. saying because I know Miami not Miami not your team. No, like, I you know, know that, I know that, but I'm saying he the tallest one on Miami team. But, but yeah, in so the I, first I, half, four points, you uh, cannot do that. I'm sorry, he did get seven uh, rebounds in the first half, but uh, no, the points has to go up. Yeah, the points nine, gotta go up. Shit, shit, look, he had nine. Look, you look, look what you said. You said he had four and seven. At halftime, he in the game with six and nine. So shit, he ain't did too much. Two two. So he ain't really did much. I forget that. what game it was. I'm not sure if it was game because this six game right now. Five away. Yes, last game. What the we, fifth what, game. What, what, it yeah. wasn't shit. Fourth game. It wasn't yeah. shit. Maybe it was the third game. Yeah. And he had about twenty something points. I forget what game was that. I get it. Was what it the about? second? What do you think about Matt Shroops tonight in 34 minutes? 13 points, two rebounds, two assists. He shot the ball pretty hard, but two to do for Shroops could do more than that. I know he could do more than that. He shot five from 12. He could do more than that. Three point ball, three point line. He could do more than that. You got to do so much. I feel like he's shooting the ball for too far, number one. I don't like And Vincent, Vincent, Vincent had. Ain't had no points in the first half. Zero fucking points. He only had one steal and one assist. Uh-huh. That, in the first half. That's a fact. He usually be hitting them threes. Bang, bang, bang. He ain't doing none of that shit. Man, shit. That's a fact. Him and Ola Depot in the first half. Oh, you, my shit. God. Him and Ola Depot. Yeah. So, you right about that? Shit. Jesus. I was getting Butler the did. Butler did. Butler did his fucking job tonight. He did, did his job. fucking job. You get, you get, and, and shit I like about this, you get, you get PJ, you get PJ Tucker in 24 minutes tonight, 11 points, five rebounds. PJ do all the solid shit. PJ, yeah. Was pretty cool. he, P, like, he I feel like he ain't get, I ain't, I don't feel like he got in his spot tonight, though. No, nah, he went you two know, for two tonight in threes tonight. No, yeah, but he I went know two he for two in that corner. Now. Once they passed yeah. that ball to him in that corner. Yeah. He hit right. that shit. Now he, now he, he, got, he only shot two attempts and now he made both of them. He was yeah. tonight in three. But I feel shit, like he, he ain't getting his corner enough. You know when he's getting like his they, corner is like, a rat. I feel like they're closing out on him though. But Boston play real, real different. Like I feel like they, listen, if Boston get rid I mean, if Miami get rid of Boston in this series, that same shot for PJ will be open with Golden State. They ain't close out on PJ like that. He'll be like a Draymond Green. They ain't close out like that. I promise mm. you, bro. And see, I promise you, it'll be a di- I promise you, we'll watch, watch now. They ain't gonna close out on Tucker like that. Tucker remind me of uh, um, uh, uh, Porter, Porter from Milwaukee, who was staying that corner all day. Mm-hmm. Now, same mm-hmm. thing as Al Horford, that's all he do. <laughs> just sit right in the Horford corner, and wait for the ball to come low. his way. So, you think yeah. about Horford, Horford can go down low and make a present, but let's keep it a buck now. Like, Horford sit in that corner too and knock that three down. He just can go down low, nigga. Um, PJ Tucker gonna shoot the ball just like this nigga um Bobby Porters. They gonna shoot the ball. Yeah. That's their corner. Yeah. But man, listen, man. Man, listen, man. I'm, I'm me personally, you know, I'm a little biased. I'm happy tonight. No, but Ben I'm got. I'm man, sorry, Ben like. got put up them numbers for me, cause he he need to get a fucking aggressive. Man, gotta do better he than that. needs to get aggressive. I feel I like he too soft. Man. He too fucking soft. He needs to fucking mm, mm, make his way to that fucking Jersey. basket. Jersey, nigga. He, yeah, nigga man, nigga that's Jersey right there. Right. He gotta make right. his way to that fucking right. basket. I'm like, sorry. Shit, right. He gotta that shit, bulldoze them motherfuckers. Right. Fuck that. I gotta that. tell you about you little John. Listen. I gotta tell you know, about John. That's, that's a cat I breed. That boy gonna make a name for that man. He got hurt, though. Like I tell you, my job, I feel you. A Jersey breed. You gotta make a name for yourself, Nick. Yeah. Well, that me pulling that goddamn um Red Bull. You know, I need some Red Bull. I the fuck around with these niggas. You know, fuck up. On Sipping Sports TV, man. Make sure y'all like, subscribe, and share on Sipping Sports TV, man. Hit that I'm notification up, bell. Exactly, <laughs> man. Support, man. You want to support to the cash up at Sipping Sports TV, man. For real, man. 
for here, man. I'm I'm out. Covering this Miami game, but old lady wouldn't get on right now and talk about. Uh, uh. She don't like what I say about Bam on loud now, so she want to get on live tonight and talk about Bam. Talk good shit about Jersey. You got to give me more points than that. I'm sorry. No, he got to give me more points. You know that? He got to give me more points. No, you got to come out better than that. I ain't going to lie. 41 minutes, he got to come out better than that. He got to give me more points. I only take six attempts. He remind me of... Uh, uh, Tatum, look at how many points he got tonight. How many points he got tonight? Take. Tatum took 12 attempts. Tatum went nine for 12 tonight. No, I'm points. talking about Ben. How many points Bam he got tonight? Six shots tonight. Six shots tonight from the field goal. Three for six tonight, baby. So you telling me, six. hold on. <laughs> no, this can't be real. So you telling me that, um, what's the nigga name off of Golden State? The big nigga, Looney. You telling me Looney can make more shots than, than Bam now? Is this what's going on? Man, Looney bigger than Bam, though. You gotta remember this, man. Talk about weight down in the paint, bro. Lo- listen, Looney, that's what I'm not. saying. See, see what Bam got it. See, see, listen, sweetheart. See, listen, sweetheart. See, listen, sweetheart. What you looking at is 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 is, is more uh, uh, agile, more more quicker, and more 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 agile. Like Bam is more, yeah, the athletic than Looney, but Looney is solid in the paint. It's hard for Bam to score, and then Bam like, ain't perfect that jump shot and shit yet either. Once he's perfect that, uh, Bam will be a problem. But it's like they let Bam shoot right now, shoot that. Like I'm telling you, bro, Looney is a, like a present. Now we had to get them bitches in foul trouble. They talked to they you. talked to Looney the uh, last couple games. They talked to that motherfucker. They said, "Nigga, <laughs> if you don't know what the yeah, fuck you supposed to do." <laughs> <laughs> he started putting up fucking points. He started doing every fucking thing down yeah, by Dream on Green and niggas like that. And then shot the Dream on Green over there in in, in, in Golden State because he, he he run that shit. I promise you, bro. He made he made life easy for Curry and Clay. Boy, he make them boys life easy, bro. How you think them boys get them shots? And then they move the ball. They move the ball like I, like no other. So. They move the ball. And then you got uh Wiggins coming on right now. Wiggins might be the X Factor for of they winning it. Oh yeah. That's the, that's the baby Durant. Not quite Durant, but you know what I'm saying. You see what I'm saying? Yeah. He still look got like a long Durant. ways to go. Little slim but, nigga. You know yeah. that look like Durant. Look tall. All right. All right. Man, that's what I'm trying to tell you, man. That's what I'm saying. That this this this, this shit is. This playoffs is crazy, man. I, I, I gotta keep it a buck with you. I'm gonna get into this. I'm, 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 I'm gonna go back tonight since you on that. I, I guess I got you on that night with me since you on it. You wanna talk about it? I'm gonna go. No, back. I'm, I'm gonna get back on. I'm gonna get back on. I'm gonna go back to game five. All right, all right. I'm gonna go back I'm gonna to get game back five. All right. I'm gonna go back to game five. I'm gonna go back to goddamn game five with this shit, man. Where up? This is Seppin Sports TV. I had the old lady on the night. You know, she be into it. You know, she be into the sports and shit. You know, she try to be into the sport. That's why I fucks with her, man. Like, this what I would say, man. Get your woman that into the shit, too. Like, this how you in, in tune with you. And not just not in tune with you, in tune with what they want to do. Like, I in tune with her shit. Like, whatever you want to do, I support it. She support my shit to, to, to the T. Like, get, 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 get to something like that. And I, and I respect this shit, because it's not about Who's up? We like we live in some shit like nigga. We 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 know we good and we know what we capable of. That's what we always say to each other. So I keep it like that. I keep it solid. This is my sports TV game. Let me get into this. Though. Let me get into this game. This um closeout game. You can see it now. It's a fucking closeout game now. Game five in Golden State. The Dallas Mavericks versus the Golden State Warriors. Through the whole series, you was like, shit, they ain't even a chance. I know most people would have said they ain't even a chance. And them boys gonna win that. Tell you the truth. 
I didn't even hardly think Dallas was gonna win. I actually took Dallas. I'm gonna be real with you though. See, most niggas will get on here and lie about their bet. I get on and tell you the truth. I took Dallas in this series. Even though I know ain't no way possible in hell that's gonna really win this series, but unless niggas didn't make shots and and to keep it real with you, same as um, Boston and Miami right now. Everybody just picked Boston to win the thing because it's like, oh, Boston is younger and and and, and Miami hurt, which Miami is hurt, but they just picked Boston to win over Miami, like like not knowing, not, not thinking like Miami is a professional basketball team too. You you do have stars on that team. We do have championship winners on that team, like PJ Tucker. You do have uh, uh, Kyle Landry on that team. We have winners on that team now. You have a Butler who been on who been to the finals already now. You got a young Miami team that's coming on, but Miami play all the right way. I, I don't feel like why Miami shouldn't win. Game, I need game five. Game five, I need game five. Game five, man. Golden State, Dallas Mavericks. Uh, uh, uh. Out from the gate. Draymond plays strong. Golden State plays strong out the gate. Golden State plays strong out the gate. Golden State never plays strong out the gate. He, he had um. Green was aggressive and night, not even just being green. Green got on the scoreboard and I think Green had like 15, 17 night. That, that was, green was aggressive tonight. Very aggressive tonight. You had Green driving. You had uh, uh Wiggins being aggressive. You had Clay Thompson though. He stole the show. Clay Thompson stole the show early. Early. <laughs> early. Clay Thompson stole the show early. Like it, it, the the first quarter, the halftime, through the whole game, really. Clay Thompson controlled the game. I think Clay Thompson was a high man tonight. If I'm not for sure, I'm pretty sure. I think Luca probably was high man tonight with the but Clay Thompson dominated the game tonight in Game Five. Golden State won the first quarter, 28-23. Second quarter, you would think. This game was funny now. See, this game was so funny. Because Golden State not even known for that second half burst, that second quarter burst, so I should say. They know for that shit in the third quarter. It revert this game reversed it. They hit that's with the blitz in the second quarter. 41 to 29. Dallas came back and responded in the third quarter, 32 to 25. Dallas made the game even. Dallas cut the game down to double digits. What? Much as what? Eight, nine? Never close to that. Dallas actually won the full quarter, 26 26. This game wasn't really that close until. About five, six minutes left in the third quarter to the full quarter to a little bit at the end of the full quarter when, when Golden State finally pulled away. Because the first quarter, Golden State really dominated the first quarter. Clay Thompson was a monster. Clay Thompson was a monster. We, we just have to keep it the buck with you. This was one of the game of his life right now. First, after coming back off of them AC, ACL injuries, I think he had two knee ACs. So, this. You took your hat. I took my hat to 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 them to, to them because they needed that. They needed him. Mind is Dallas can't make the shots tonight. Dallas can't make the shot. Dallas is a two way team. Two way team meaning they different at home, and then they go small on GTA. Go small organization on go small on GTA. They go small for about two two minutes, and in that two minute period. 
go to state but they score 20 points they go some old to the point where Dallas never had enough. They never got enough. And they don't even have the defense to even slow Golden State down enough to even do that, to make Golden State, because they're getting backdoor passes and everything. Now, Luka and Wiggins match up favorite Wiggins in this series. Even minus Luka dropping the numbers he dropped. That matchup favorite Wiggins in this series. That's good. Now, we're going to have to admit that. That matchup figure Wiggins in this series. Because Wiggins was able to play defense, no complaining, getting back, playing defense, and scoring. 